Well, tonight, an eerie update to a bizarre story. More than 100 cremated remains have yet to be reunited with families. Tonight, one Oakland family finally knows why they were forced to hold their father's funeral without his cremated remains and why the crematorium they entrusted never answered their calls. Turns out their father's remains were in a warehouse, along with so many others. Here's NBC Barry's Stephanie Marion. The damage and the toll that is taken on our family, like I said, is just immeasurable. The nightmare started in November of 2021 when Rasan Robinson's father was killed in the city of Oakland. He says by December he thought he had found a business that would help his family mourn and say goodbye to Lawrence Sterling Robinson, someone he called a pillar in the community of Richmond. He was going to uh, cremate my father and uh, mail my father's remains to me. He got my address information, he got my credit card information, he built my credit card and told me everything was going to be fine. But the weeks went by. It was the end of January 2022. So Robinson now, says his calls and text messages to the owner of Ocean View Crematory in Hayward were ignored. So they held a funeral without his father's remains and they called police. Uh, the Oakland Police Department informed my sister that approximately 17 other families had already filed some of their claims against this individual. Not only was it hard to get a hold of the business, Robinson says he couldn't find the crematory. The address on his receipt didn't match. It was July when he finally found his father and the business. I walk into the gentleman's office. There are at least 10 other uh, boxes of remains sitting on his desk. He's sitting there smoking a cigar. He's extremely cavalier about the entire situation, like disrespectfully so. He learned there was no death certificate and says the county records office had no connection with the business. And nearly a year later, a massive investigation. The Alameda County Sheriff's Office says six bodies and 154 cremated remains dated back to 2013 were found in a warehouse linked to Ocean View cremations. If they did business with Ocean View between 2013 and 2021, it's, you know, it's likely we may have remains that belong to them. So far, only 15 families have been connected to the cremated remains. Five bodies have been identified. The sixth has a tentative identification. We're told the Hayward business was suspended in 2022 and the corporation license was suspended in 2018. I just try to do right by my dad. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I know there's a lot of other families out there that was just trying to do right by their family. And, and you know, I just hope that he gets some justice. The future of this case is now in the hands of the state. Stephanie Magallon, NBC Bay Area News.